You guys can you make your own individual circuit. These are the supplies that you need. A pair of scissors, a half a piece of paper, a battery, three LED lights, copper tape, and regular scotch tape. The first thing you want to do is fold over one corner of the paper. This will become your switch. And then you will put copper tape all the way down so that you can flip the switch over onto the back. For the other side of the tape, you want to make sure that you give yourself plenty of space right between the two sides so that you can connect it. Next, I'm going to attach my battery and I am going to put the, you see the positive sign there? I'm gonna put that um, on this side of the tape. So, right, this is going to be my positive side of my circuit. I am going to tape the battery on so that there's a way for this tape to make contact with the battery to create the circuit. So I don't want to cover the whole battery, I just want to secure it with the tape. The longer wire on the LED light is the positive side. So I'm just going to test the light and um, just set it down on the positive side and sure enough, it lights up. You can position your lights any way you want on the strip. So just to verify what orientation I want. Which is working, which it is, All right? I press on it. All right, so when I poke the hole and put my green light through the hole, I have to keep the positive side on this side. I can't turn it around, so I know I need to poke it in this way. Okay, so I'm going to lay it down in the orientation that I want, and I'm going to use a pencil to just poke a hole where I'm going to put the light. Okay, so <clears throat> the red light um, won't work in the circuit with the blue and the green. It robs the power. So I, it looks like I can do it with another green light. And once your switch is working consistently, then you can add your drawing as you wish. You want to make a piece of artwork. I recommend starting with crayon with pencil and then using marker afterwards. I'm choosing a simple sketch. Uh, again, you can choose whatever you want. Final thing I need to do is add a push arrow. I also want you to understand that the electricity or the electrons flow from the negative side of this battery when I complete the circuit, they flow down this negative, across the bridge, and back to the positive side of the battery. They also flow this way, right through that second light and through the third light. So I'm going to have you draw that on your diagram as well. Right, that the electricity flows from the battery, across the light, down the copper tape. It also flows across this light, 
and down the copper tape and it flows through this light and down the copper tape. So make sure to write on the back of your diagram, indicate the flow of electricity. So the flow of electricity is happening behind the diagram. Fun times, happy circuit building.